Welcome to Suburban Living. This is Ed. Got out the 68 today and the 8 inch plow to plow the garden. This is pretty easy plowing here. This is where we, we've had our garden. I don't have anybody to film for me today, so I thought I would just plow part of it. Show you what we got going on. It's a little later than we normally plow. It's just been so cold and so rainy this year. Here's the plow down in the ground. Pulls it pretty well. I, I don't have any chains on this tractor. And the uh, rear rear tires aren't loaded either. I do have uh, wheel weights on them. When I start spinning, which is just maybe occasionally, not every row, I'll start spinning a little bit. I'll just grab the handle and I'll just tug up on it just a little bit. And it normally is enough to for it to regain enough traction and start again. This thing's been setting for well, probably a month since it's been started. It started the first pull today. There's that Honda clone engine. That'll get me a thumbs down or two from some people. Beautiful day here. It'll be about 80 today here in West Virginia. So I thought I'd get this spot turned over. Let that uh, kind of set a few days before I disc and, and till it. Let me show you what else we got going here. Got a big mess, really. Got some of these piles. I wanted to burn them, but I live in town here, small town, but windy as it has been, I hated to burn these piles that I cut. Built this compost bin yesterday. Very, very simple. I just uh, found three pallets. Took a uh, couple t-posts just one on each side like that drove them in just put a cement block behind probably would not have needed that then I wired wired the corners now this obviously is not the sturdiest thing you've ever seen in your life but just a simple compost bin a place to put our compost so that's what we got going on here in our household thought i'd just share it with you today have a have a great day and thanks for watching